Hello, you guys. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to share this bag with you. A lot of you guys have been asking me, like, how do I transport my classic size planner plus all of my kids' stuff with me all day long? So, this is technically a diaper bag and it's made by the company Lily Jade. So, you can see the logo here. These bags are phenomenal. <laughs> so, this bag is full grain leather so it is just buttery soft and the quality is out of this world this bag is the one with the silver hardware as well as the jade inside and so i'll show you that as well there is also a black version of this bag that comes with red on the inside but you can check out their website and i'll link them down below <laughs> this bag was purchased with my own money this is definitely not a sponsorship of any kind so this is my 100 percent real review of this bag and I absolutely love her. So the other cool thing about this bag is that you can wear it three ways. So you can use the shoulder strap, you can wear it messenger style, which is what I do most of the time, or you can use these D-rings here to make it backpack style. So, so wearing it both messenger and backpack are probably my favorite ways to wear this bag. The straps are really nice, but I feel like when the bag is really full, they tend to fall off of my shoulders. And I just tend to have like a more round shoulder so that might just be like my issue and as you can see the hardware on this bag is just like out of this world amazing amazing quality as well so I'm definitely someone who likes a nice bag so I wanted to show you everything that I carry with me and of course things change like a day to day this is how my bag is packed on most days when I'm out with my kids so let's just go ahead and get into it so this is the Madeline Lily Jade bag and again I will link the Madeline down below let's Let's just go ahead and get into this bag so the Madeline has this flap here with a magnetic closure so there's no velcro anywhere on this bag which is amazing because I typically kind of hate velcro and I hated it when my son was a newborn because it woke him up but I also just like the look of a magnet more so inside this front pouch I just carry my Jujube B Charged. And in here, I just have all of my gift cards, any like punch cards that we may need. That's where all of like my extra cards go that I don't necessarily use on like a day-to-day -day basis. And this is a great little pocket for it. So this pocket doesn't hold very much. I've had a pack of gum in there before, plus a pen and that fit. But my iPhone 6S with the case does not fit in here. It might fit without the case, but that would be kind of a hassle to take the case off and on all the time. So just a few small things can fit in there and that works really well to have that little be charged in that pocket and then I actually have nothing in this center pocket and nothing oh wait <laughs> I lied there is something down in here I have just that pack of gum down in that side pocket on the right hand side and then on this side I just have my sunglasses and yeah that's a great place to have them so that I can easily access them so yep sunglasses in here and nothing in the middle pocket just so that the flap closes is a little bit better I find when there's nothing in that pocket so yep so that is everything in that part and then in the back pocket here I've seen some people keep like their extra straps in here that kind of thing and that's kind of a sneak peek as to what the interior color is gonna look like it's gorgeous and in here I just keep so back here I just keep my petunia pickle bottom tote bag and I forget the name of this print but I can link it down below these totes are amazing because they fold super duper flat and they are just really nice to have on the go as an extra bag should you need them now let's go ahead and get into kind of the meat of the bag oh last thing before we go inside I forgot to mention this is a Lily Jade signature on all of their bags you get this gorgeous tassel and it also comes with this really high quality bead and then these three jade beads right here so this is just something that I really love on my bag it's one of my favorite parts about having a Lily Jade so this is definitely great to have so this is what the inside of what my I guess not diaper bag my mom bag looks like and it has everything in here that I could possibly need with both kids all day long now I will say that most of the things in here are for myself and my toddler my 10 year old typically carries either like a purse of her own or a backpack of her own but there are a few things in here that should she need them that I have for her she's 10 almost 11 so she's pretty 
pretty self-sufficient but again most of the stuff in here is for myself and my toddler and my toddler is two and like three quarters <laughs> he'll be three in September so he is almost three but he still needs quite a bit of things so inside this bag there are multiple compartments but it also has an insert and that is where most of the organization comes because it's a big big bag so what I'll do is I'll go ahead and take the insert out and then we can kind of go through what's in the bag and then I will show you what I have in the insert and kind of what that's all about all right so this is the inside of the Lily Jade Madeline and it's definitely more of like a horizontal packing type bag but I really like that because I felt like I had not as much space in my vertical packing bag when I was using it and just for reference I used a petunia pickle bottom sachet satchel and that was definitely like my favorite diaper bag of all of them this bag is just just, you cannot even compare to a Lily Jade in my opinion so I love it so so much so in here I usually stand these up next to the insert and so I have just two play packs in here one for my son which is the cars one he's a car guy and then one for my daughter so it's just from the emoji movie and basically they just have like crayons and stickers and a coloring thing and so I just have these in here if I need to throw something at them not not literally if I need to give them something to keep them entertained maybe we're like at the DMV or something or we're at a restaurant or something like that so these are just in here purely to save my sanity and to keep them entertained and then let's see this is hard to do with one hand so I also just keep my keys on this gorgeous leather key fob and I've seen a lot of packing videos for this bag and not a lot of people use the key fob but I really like key fobs because then I know exactly where my keys are even if I can't find them they are somewhere close to the key fob so I definitely like to use those in this little pocket right here I don't have anything just because it's so small I could put like a hair tie in there in fact I might just do that in this pocket I don't have anything either because I think it gets kind of hidden once the insert is in here and then but I would definitely use those pockets if it was just like a mommy bag like if I just was taking this bag somewhere and I can show you that too because I plan to use this bag as a work bag as well in here I typically will keep my messenger strap which is this guy so I will typically keep that in there if I'm not using it and then I also have two petunia pickle bottom stroller straps so if I wanted to use this bag and hang it on a stroller I could definitely do that using those straps as well so that actually gives me a fourth carrying option if I wanted to so I think that is everything for the inside of the bag and it's super super spacious in here there's just a lot of room you can carry so many things as you'll see using the insert so let me go ahead and show you how I use the insert next and so the bag definitely keeps the most of its shape when it's empty as well which I really really like so it does have something kind of heavy here and something kind of heavy on the back which is kind of pulling on the shape of it but I love that even just sitting empty it keeps like the majority of its shape which is gorgeous okay so this is the insert and so as you can see it has so many pockets so much room for you to carry everything including a classic size happy planner and we'll get into that but you can carry so 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 much just using this insert you could also even just pull the insert out and leave it with someone if you didn't necessarily want to leave your whole diaper bag or like your purse with somebody basically so let me just go ahead and show you what I have in here so even though my son is no longer in diapers I definitely keep a booty pod in here with some wipes because we were at Costco this morning and he's like I need a napkin or you know whatever he said for his hands and so I was able to just grab one out of here so if you have kids baby wipes are a must even if they're not in diapers <laughs> and then in here this is one of those hospital puke bags and I keep these ones in my diaper bag because you never know when you're gonna have a puke accident and I cannot tell you how many times these have saved me they have like a structured rim and just like a plastic bag that you can quickly use and I know it's like something gross that we all don't necessarily want to think about my cousin works at the hospital she is like a nurse and so she picks these up for us all the time I'm just like can you grab me some more of those I need them because it's season so definitely keep that in my diaper bag just to have and then over here on this side pocket I just keep a stackable like snack tower and this was full of snacks earlier but I rinsed it out and put it back in here just so I could show you guys what I typically carry and so again this is for my son mostly but I usually use the bigger bottom one for my daughter if she wants to have a snack of some kind and then the top two smaller ones for my son so this is super super handy and I believe the brand of this one is skip hop and I'll 
I'll go ahead and link it down below. I just picked this up on Amazon. Oh, and something else to know about this particular snack tower is that this blue lid and this red lid are both watertight. So if you were going to use it to like carry formula and water, that kind of thing, you could definitely do that. So those lids are watertight, just so you have that heads up. Okay, and then over on this other side, I have, I think this is called like the Jujube Be Prepared or Be Organized. I always forget the little names that they use, but it's just like a mesh bag. And I initially got this in like a pumping set. There's a wet bag and then there's a freezer bag and then there's this mesh bag as well that you can use. And I at first used it to carry around like my pump parts and that kind of thing. But now I just use it to throw around some cars or some toys or whatever to keep my son entertained. So those are great to have on hand and this bag makes it so easy to transport them. And then in this pocket right here, I have my Kate Spade Kara wallet and I love this wallet. It was inspired by Kate Schwenke. I recently saw her packing video of this diaper bag and she had this wallet in her diaper bag as well and I was like, oh my gosh, that wallet is gorgeous, but it was super hard to find. I did end up finding it on eBay and I absolutely love it. So my driver's license is in here, so I'm not gonna like open this up and show you, but I will go ahead and link one of these down below as well. And then right over here, this is like my mom essentials bag. And this is a Jujube medium set piece in the onyx or like blackout print. And I love it because it's black and it matches my bag. I'll give you a quick peek as to what's in here. So in here, I just have some tampons. I have an inhaler because I have asthma, some face wipes. I have my little stash of mommy treats over here okay and then getting into the middle section so this is a jujube wet bag and again it came in that set with the i think it was like a pumping essential set or something like that and in here i just keep one spare outfit for my son so right now it's shorts underwear and like a tank top so so yeah that's what i keep in there for him he is potty trained but just because you never know what's gonna go down with a toddler. Okay, and then next in this middle section, I have my classic size happy planner. And again, a lot of you guys, when I shared this on Instagram, thought it was my mini. It's definitely my classic size happy planner. So yeah, it definitely has enough room to carry a classic size. And then next in here in the middle section, this is another one of those Jujube blackout set pieces. And this is a large set piece. And this is just our med kit. And I'll show you kind of what I keep in there. So I just keep some bug spray. What else is in here? Oh, like a lice comb just in case because my daughter's school has had some scary outbreaks. A few little flosser things, some cough drops, some bands band-aids just a few things you know that we might need like on the go there's some lotion down in there there are like an ouch stick there's some arnica if you've never used arnica it's like a homeopathic remedy for pain just a few little things that we could possibly need while we're out and on the go okay and down in here this is just my little pack of tissues and I picked this up off of Emma's Amazon but I believe the gal who makes it is also an Etsy seller so I'll link her on Amazon but you can also find her on Etsy if you'd like to use that as well. Never leave the house without this because it is a lifesaver. Down in this next pocket, I just have some travel silverware for my son because you never know where you're going to be and you could need a smaller size spoon and fork. In here, I just have like a headband because you never know for mom life when you're going to have like flyaway hairs and that empties out the inserts. So that's what it looks like, like all empty with nothing in it. There's even a zipper pocket over there should you want to use it. So it's actually really nice. The older ones are shorter without handles but I think they did have a zipper so I kind of wish this one had a zipper over the top of it just so you could store other stuff on top of it but other than that I really like this insert and overall I really love the Lily Jade Madeline bag and so that's everything I have to share with you guys today as far as my mom planner life bag so again I will link Lily Jade down below and all of the other items down below if you have other questions about like my mom planner bag feel free to let me know down in the comments below if you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. If you are one of my current subscribers, thank you so much for all of your love and support. You guys are the wind beneath my wings and I absolutely adore each and every one of you. You are so special to me. So here is your internet hug for the day. And if you're new around here, don't forget to hit that red subscribe button down below. And by the way, you guys have fun today.